jumping into a rant right now. And, and a lot of you know that my rants are always started by a comment that I get, and then I get passionate about it, and then I kind of go off. So a friend of mine this morning had an appointment, um, had, a, um, had a client that was training with him, my buddy's a trainer, and the client was giving him a hard time about being available today. And my buddy, who's the trainer, ends up moving his schedule around to um, accommodate this client and the client oversleeps. All right, now, the purpose of this rant is to not sit here and not rip on this individual who overslept, because listen, we're all human beings, we all make mistakes. But I wanna to talk to you guys about something called priorities, all right? How badly do you want to make change? Are you prioritizing this? Because if you're going to that party and you're sitting there and you're giving in to the cakes and the ice cream and the alcohol when it's not your time to do that, then that's on you. You need to accept responsibility for that. That is not the fault of your coach. That is not the fault of your nutritionist. You need to accept responsibility for the fact that if you are not staying on your nutrition plan, if you are not staying on your training plan, that there is a cost to doing business. And I'm not saying you can't turn around and you can't have a cheat meal on occasions. I just was dieting down for the last five weeks. I had absolutely no alcohol and no cheat meals. And you know what? I went last night, had some food, had some alcohol, went into my training session this morning, had a great training session, felt off. Right now, I feel like I look a little off. There's a cost of doing business. That's on me. That's no one's fault. That's not... That's not my training plan's fault. That's not my nutritional plan's fault. That is not the fault of, um, of, the, uh, of the supplements I'm taking. That is something that I accepted. That is something that I went and I embarked on and I knew there's a cost of doing business. I'm gonna go do this and I'm not gonna feel at my 100% today. So I accept it. A lot of you need to start accepting responsibilities for your own actions. Unfortunately, if you are always in a caloric deficit, not a good thing. It ain't working, it's time to change it. All right, you can't continually be in a caloric deficit and expect to keep removing calories and starve yourself and expect to get into better shape. That's not gonna happen, it's physically impossible, so any nutritionist telling you that is wrong. Okay, we all know that. Guys, prioritize, gain a plan. If you are getting the wrong advice, from someone, if you are getting the wrong nutrition plan, if what you are doing is not working and it's not on you, okay, you need to take a little bit more of a um, serious approach to what it is you're trying to do. And I, I can't tell you how many people will reach out to me and are initially just unhappy with where they are, their fitness, what they're doing. And then the second you go to give them advice, they don't want to hear it. They're not listening to you. They're stubborn. We'll continue to do what you're doing. It's not working. So the purpose of this rant today is to prioritize. One, prioritize where you are putting your focuses into. If you are taking a half-ass approach on your fitness and nutrition, if you're skimping up a little bit too much, that is on you, all right? Find someone else new to motivate you. Find a new training program. Find a new nutritionist. Get a new beginning. Find a new beginning. Find a new way to motivate yourself, all right? But a lot of what we have to do now comes down to the responsibility that we're putting on ourselves. And giving you that example of that individual this morning that slept through the session, they're gonna continue to complain when that is on them. Set an alarm clock. You are not in the third grade anymore. You are a grown adult. You wanna turn around and you wanna better yourself. Then you have to take a little bit more of a serious approach into all this that you're, that you're doing that might not be working. Sorry guys, that's my rant today though.